Hi everybody, Scott Strude here from Retool. So I'm gonna quickly take you through all your different menu options within Retool Match. Um, so first off, in order to get to your menus, you simply just click on the Retool mark, word mark that's up in the upper left at any point uh, when you're operating Match. All right, so for starters, you've got this as your starting point in your menus. Obviously it gives you all of your information. Um, if you need to manage your account, your locations, your employees, you can click on one of these three down here and that would actually kick you out to another web page. If you need to actually change your language, um, you just click that blue button right there and it'll bring up all your different options for languages within Retool Match. If you need to log out because, uh, or you wanna log somebody else out because you're using Retool Match and somebody else has been logged in, you simply just hit that log out button and uh, as you've seen, now that we save your credentials within Retool Match, the login is much faster. And then version notes um, is exactly that. We update Match on about a monthly cadence, and we wanna be able to always keep you guys up to date with what uh, new features are available within Retool, Retool Match. So if you're out of the office, uh, out of the store, the day that you, the most recent uh, Match update came through and you wanna see what was updated, you can always just click on that. Within advanced options, uh, the top one here is very important for any retailers that are doing body geometry custom footbeds. You want to check that box because what will happen is once you've taken the rider through the foot module within Retool Match, rather than it just saying their uh, body geometry SL footbed recommendation, it'll actually say either custom footbeds recommended or custom footbeds available. It'll say custom footbeds available if both of their seat shoot, uh, both of their feet recommended the same footbed. So blue on the left, blue on the right. Um, it'll say custom footbeds recommended if they, for example, had a blue on the left and a green on the right. Tracker connected. Obviously, if you're having any issues with collecting data within Retool Match, you wanna make sure that your tracker is connected. Um, if, you, if it's not connected, just hit the reset connection there. And if you've hit that a couple times and it's not actually resetting, then you probably need to uh, plug the dongle in that's in the back of the match tower. And um, you could always just reach out to Retool and we can walk you through how to do that. Uh, switching channel, very important. If you have more than one Vantage in your store, so for example, if you use Retool for bicycle fitting and also for Retool Match, then you uh, wanna make sure that anything fit related is turned off because if you switch the channel on your match tower and anything is on within your fit studio, it'll change the channel on that as well, okay? And then suggest channels does exactly that. It simply just um, looks around, basically looks at the environment, it sees which channels are strongest, and then it recommends a channel based on that. All right, and in order to get back, you simply just hit the X there, and this is the retool mark, word mark I was telling you about, you simply hit that, and it'll bring up.